All right guys, so have you ever gotten a percent off coupon? Maybe 40% off of facial care or 50% off makeup and you're just not sure how to use it? Well, today I'm gonna to show you an example of how to use it and what is the best way to use percent off coupons and answer the question, can you use a coupon at CVS on a, an item that is free? Welcome back guys. I have been posting some of these videos on how to make your CRTs work for you only be, simply because this is what I am doing and I have the receipts to show you what is truly working at CVS with CRTs. Um, you know, we always have things that there's updates or they're doing this or some stores do this and everything kind of works differently. But I want to show you that in the past three weeks, um, things that I've done and changed are number one, I'm doing way smaller transactions and I'm doing more of them. So, um, you know, you might want to check the other two videos to kind of get up to speed with some different scenarios. Um, and two, you know, I am just putting together my deals and I'm not stressing about doing all the deals in one day. Um, I'm doing the ones that I want to do first. And then if I have to go back to CVS for like a second haul or a second trip, whatever, I can go ahead and do that. That way I can focus and give my attention to the deals and do them correctly. All right, so I have two, two scenarios for you guys this week. The first scenario is using the 40% Neutrogena CRT. And what is a CRT? Well, to get my CRTs each week at CVS, I simply take my extra care card and scan it at the big old red box machine at CVS. So if you have an extra care card and um, you are couponing for about, I would say a good month, you should start getting coupons at the red box machine. If you're not, call CVS customer service and let them know. So I take my extra care card, scan it, and um, what had printed was a 40% off Neutrogena with the rest of my CRT. So these are really particular when you're using them because the deal can be really good or it can be not so good. So there's things to look out for when you are doing those deals. So let's go ahead and check out the scenario that I did this week at CVS. So scenario number one is using a percent off coupon. This particular percent off coupon was not off of an entire purchase. I have not gotten those coupons in a long time. It was a coupon for 40% off of your Neutrogena purchase and um, Neutrogena facial care purchase rather. So it was only good on the facial items and it was up to a $99 value, the coupon, meaning that I could only you know, save $99 was the max. So whenever you get a percent off coupon, on a particular item such as the Neutrogena, I like to go ahead and look in the ad and see is Neutrogena on sale this week. If it is on sale, the percent off coupon will not work on sale items. However, this week was a great week to use it because it was part of an extra buck deal. Now, if it is part of an extra buck deal and it is at regular price, you can indeed use that percent off coupon and that is what I did. So the extra buck deal was spend 30, get a $10 extra buck reward. So what I did was I really wanted to get this anti-wrinkle serum, and this is $23.79. So I wanted to grab something that was around $7. This was the closest item to that, this Neutrogena Deep Clean Cream Cleanser. This was $7.99. So I purchased these two together. I'm going to show you guys the receipt and show you exactly um, what my final balance for these two items was. Now keep in mind they're a they're like almost $32 retail before tax. So we'll see what I paid. All right, and here is the receipt. So there's the $7.99 item and then there is the serum for $23.79. For this transaction, I did use a four off of 18 facial care CRT that will adjust your percentage off. However, as a couponer to couponer, I mean, if I have a CRT that I'm going to be able to use, I am indeed going to pair it up with this deal. Um, and then I also had the 40% off CRT on Neutrogena facial care. So the 40% off took $11.12. So I'm going to show you exactly where that 40% number came from. 
All right, so I'm just going to use my calculator and I'm going to go back and forth from the receipt to the calculator to show you exactly where that 1112 came from. So um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to add the 799 plus the 2379. So there it brought it to 3178. I need to subtract that $4 CRT, making it 2778. So then what I do is I multiply that by 40. And that is exactly how they figured out the $11.12 for my 40% off. Now, let's clear, let's do something else. I forgot the total for the two products, so I have to add again, 31 something, 31.78. Now, if I didn't use that CRT, let's multiply it by 40% and see what it would have been. It would have been $12.71, which is great. But it's, I got a $4 CRT. You'd be crazy not to use it because you're, you're still getting, you know, three, you know, close to $3 more off. So it's definitely beneficial to use your CRTs if you can. Now, let me show you guys an example. So if you notice here, I paid good old cash for this. Well, the, the ending of the deal was it was $16.66. We're going to do pre-tax for the two items. And then I got back a $10 extra buck. So essentially, um, $31.78 worth of products were just $6.66. So huge savings, especially if you get these percent off coupons on products that you use use them. I know sometimes we're afraid to use them because we don't know how to use them. Now, if I had paid with a $10 extra buck, that extra buck would have been taken off before my 40%. So I'm going to do the calculation again. I do remember that the total was $31.78 for the products minus the $4 CRT and minus a $10 extra buck. So $17.78 would have been the amount that the 40% would come off of. So times 0.40. So I would have gotten $7.11 off using that extra buck reward, meaning that's almost what that's for. That's exactly $4 less than what I had got by paying cash. Now the stinker is paying cash. You have to pay cash. But it does have a benefit to you because you are getting a higher percentage off and um, it makes the coupon more effective in your deals better. So if you guys have questions on this scenario or how to use a percent off coupon or if you're using a percent off coupon and have some questions, comment below. All right. And I also have a, another scenario for you. It's a makeup scenario. So this current week at CVS, there was a great deal. When you bought a Neutrogena face product, you got a free lip or eye product. And when you went to the cashier and you put your products up there and she scanned your face product and then she scanned your eye or lip product, it automatically came up as free. So it showed zero as far as costs. Um, a big question is, can you use a manufacturer coupon on a free item at CVS? The answer is yes. Um, I've even asked my cashiers, um, and I have a scenario here that shows you exactly what happened when I did use a printable coupon, printable manufacturer coupon on the free product. All right, and this next scenario is with some Neutrogena Cosmetics. So Neutrogena Cosmetics had a special promo going on, buy a face product, get a free lip or eye product. And honestly, I love Neutrogena Cosmetics. However, as a couponer and seeing the deals that we get, it's expensive. I mean, we can definitely save when we get an Ibotta bonus or we get a printable coupon or we get a manufacturer coupon. But still overall, it's definitely more expensive than all the CoverGirl and Revlon and Maybelline, all those products that we're getting. So sometimes I tend to sway away from these deals. However, treat yourself. You deserve a treat once in a while. And when you have the right coupons and it makes the right deal, it's definitely worth it. So for this particular deal, again, no extra bucks, but I did have a five off of 15 Neutrogena Cosmetics CRT. And I thought time to pair that in with this deal. Not only was I getting something free, but I was using a CRT and I found some old printable coupons, a $4 for a face product on Neutrogena and a $2.50 on a lip product. Now the question is a lot of people say, can you use a free 
Can you use a coupon on a free item at CVS? So let's say cereals, buy one, get one free. Can you use two 50 cent off coupons, one for each box? The answer is yes. And I'm gonna show you guys here in the receipt. All right, so here is the face product, $15.79. With that five off of 15, I had to reach $15. So um, I was happy to get the foundation. Um, and then I picked up the um, Neutrogena Hydra Boost Lip Balm in Almond. And you can see right away that rang up completely free. Um, you can see the promotion worked fine. There were no issues. Always good to check as your cashier is ringing up to make sure that indeed things are going the way they should. So I used that $4 coupon on the foundation. I used, as you can see, the $2.50 coupon and it came off completely fine. No issues, no beeps, nothing. And also the 5 off 15 Neutrogena Makeup CRT came off completely fine. The full value of $5 came off. Two items, my subtotal was $4.29. So essentially, if I would have bought these two products, one was almost 16 and then the lip was 9.99. We're talking $26 retail in makeup. I was able to go ahead and grab it for $4.29 pre-tax, plus these items qualify towards CVS Beauty Club, so I'm gonna be earning some towards my Beauty Club rewards. So I hope these scenarios are helpful for you. I'm not sure if this is something that you guys wanna to continue to see. Eventually, we're gonna be repeating scenarios, but Sometimes repeating things is not a bad thing. So you guys give me your feedback in the comment or if there's a scenario that you'd like to see. Again, I'm basing these on the CRTs that I get and the deals that I get so that you can actually see the receipt and see everything. But if there's something that I can do or something that I can't answer to help you guys, that is what I am here for. So thanks so much for watching. And before you leave, give this video a thumbs up and come back for some more videos. Take care.